You may stop sneezing, but the payoff for taking allergy medications is sometimes ending up groggy. It's why a lot of people are looking for more natural approaches to treating allergies. Tonight, News 2's Tiani Jones shows you some alternatives to treating seasonal allergy symptoms. There's just something about these little guys that scare most of us. The painful sting for one, but beekeeper Barry Richards says they may be the original creators of an allergy cure, honey. It doesn't go bad. Honey never spoils. They've pulled honey from Egyptian tombs that's thousands of years old, and it's still honey. In early spring in Middle Tennessee has created record amounts of pollen. In fact, Monday doctors at Vanderbilt Asthma Sinus and Allergy Program said we broke a record when it comes to pollen levels. Those allergic will often reach for the medicine cabinet, but those allergy meds can be tough on a body, so sufferers are looking for alternatives. I think a lot of people are hesitant to you know, take any more medication than they have to. So a teaspoon of honey here and a neti pot there until you find the natural approach that works for you. The neti pot is gaining popularity by flushing out allergens, but the honey method has to be honey from your local area. The theory is that the pollen gets into the honey, and as you eat the honey and the pollen inside of it, you eventually build up an immunity. Dr. David Forbes of Nashville Integrated Medicine, which treats patients using a holistic approach, says he looks at the total health of a person when it comes to allergies. Healthy people suffer less than those who have a poor diet are stressed and don't exercise. I find that people, even if they're allergic to lots of the stuff that's blooming, if they get on a very anti-inflammatory diet, getting the toxic elements, which are mainly wheat, corn, dairy, and sugar, getting those out for a period of time. And simple things like washing your hair at night can aid relieving allergy symptoms. Checking your bedding cleaning your bedding on a very regular basis. Uh, you know, we're bringing in these allergens from the outside all the time in our hair, on our clothes, it's getting in through open windows. Whether it's honey, a neti pot, or change of diet, doctors say you have to be patient and give any approach time. Tiani Jones, Nashville's News 2. And if you're not afraid of needles, acupuncture is another method being used to battle allergies.